Singapore has unveiled its first stealth weapon. It's a warship that's not only hard to detect on radar, but also packs a big punch. It's fitted with state-of-the-art wizardry, allowing it to detect and destroy targets faster and more accurately than any other Singapore Navy warship. As Kante reports, the first stealth frigate was launched today in France. Well, evidently size does matter. This here is the hull of one of the Singapore Navy's new stealth warships. And while it may not look like much now, come July, this massive piece of metal will be transformed into a 114-meter-long stealth frigate. And this will replace the Navy's older squadron of missile gunboats. In fact, compared to the gunboats and corvettes, the new frigates are almost twice the size and far more sophisticated. One of the key things is the stealth design. Uh, what this means is that it makes the ship of this size seem smaller uh, to enemy sensors than it really is. And this will give the frigate enhanced capabilities in, in terms of uh, delaying detection by the enemy. And therefore, you have more time to react. And when the frigates react, they have a heavy arsenal. There is a main naval gun and the Eurotop torpedoes, both of which are improved versions of those found on the corvette. The frigates also carry Harpoon anti-ship missiles and the new Aster anti-missile missiles. There is also a flight deck which allows the new ship to carry a medium-sized helicopter. The new ships can stay out at sea on patrol for 20 days, three times longer than its predecessor, the missile gunboats. But it's not just the hardware that's impressive. In a saturated attack where you may have a, a massive air raid, or several missiles fired at you at the same time. The combat management system will help uh, the operator in identifying which targets are the, the hostiles and which targets are threatening to the ship. Uh, in that sense, it will significantly improve the response time of the ship in terms of dealing with different types of threat, be it surface, underwater or air. Despite being able to do much more, the frigates only need a 70-man crew, half what a ship of its size usually carries. The first stealth ship, the RSS Formidable, will sail back to Singapore from France in 2005. The other five frigates in the squadron are being built locally and will be combat-ready about three years later.